so hard to deal with. Some days I just don't want to get out of bed. Some days I don't know what to do. It's been nearly a month since Antoinette Roberts lost her two-year-old son, Kendall Roberts, to a freak accident. Roberts took her older children to school and left her three-year-old daughter in Kendall in the care of adult relatives. But somehow Kendall got on top of his older brother's bunk bed. Trying to get down. And when he slipped or he fell, my daughter was trying to help him down. And her trying to help him down, they were pulling him, and that's how he lost his oxygen. When Roberts got home, he was rushed to the hospital where he later died. If you were paying attention to them or watching them or listening to them, this could have been prevented. Roberts has been sharing her story on social media and has found comfort from others who've lost children. She hopes her story makes parents realize how tragedy can strike instantly. She believes if there was more adult supervision that day, Kendall would still be here. I gave birth to this child and he's no longer here. I can't see him go to school or I can't have a school picture of him or any of that. Reports from the medical examiner's office, Kendall's death appears to be accidental. They are still investigating the official cause of death. Live in the newsroom, Christina Palladino, WISN 12 News. Thanks.